Hello everybody, Red Game Master here once again, and we are in Subnautica. I just got back from the Aurora after our last episode. And obviously we have all this stuff, a huge amount of batteries, power cells, arcade George toy, and this pressure compensator, I need to put that in. I didn't put that in before because I was worried about other stuff. Let me see, let's do that, and that. And let's start by putting these up, shall we? There we go. And you're too high. There, that's better. All right, and we actually have a new communication relay, so. This is an automated stress signal from LifePod 12, coordinates attached. Warning, life pod has sunk beyond safe diving distance. Do not attempt retrieval without submersible support. Alrighty then. Uh, let's go through what we do have. Uh, okay. Do, do, do. Take the power cell out of there. And let me see. What? Uh, do, do. Was this one full? No, it was not, but it's going to be now. And just trying to figure out how to sort everything. Oh well, for now I'll just start stuffing everything I can. And I'll have to come up with some other stuff. Um, wait, did I put something away that I shouldn't have? No, apparently not. Oh, yeah, okay. Um... You go there, you go there, you go there. There we, there we go. So, um, and I'm going to need to store away that Cyclops power, so power efficiency module. But first, let's put this in there. Where did it, did I drop it? Uh-oh, what did I do with that? I right-clicked. Right-click is drop, so then... It's supposed to be down here. Oh, just great. Oh, there it is. It must have somehow, I don't know, I guess kind of, wait, where did it go? Oh, there it is. It must have somehow kind of fused into our, our little seamoth here. Let me see, okay, just like that. Now it's 300, so now we'll be able to go to a lot deeper places. Uh, for those of you that don't remember, because I almost forgot to be completely honest something else we managed to get was a prawn suit which only needs aluminum oxide crystals plasteel and get aerogel and lubricant uh, I think I can make those plasteel ingots right now let me see what I need for those ah, fabricator make some the new tools oh wait Light stick, okay. Uh, plus steel. Plus steel ingot. Uh, titanium ingot and lithium. Oh, I need a lot of titanium for that. Okay, what about aluminum oxide crystals? Do I already have some of those? Ah, dang it. Um, hey. Come on. There we go. I don't have any aluminum oxide crystals either. And I don't know what I took out of here. I'm going to assume a battery. Can I make those? Hmm. 
Okay. Well, I guess I have some research to do as far as that goes. While we're here. There we go. Now let's see how our bioreactor's doing. Alright, it's doing good. Okay, so... I think today what I'm going to be doing is since we now have this extra depth, I'm going to see if I can go and find the uh, moon pool. Now I believe, now I know where I can find one, he's still stuck in there. The only thing is, is I don't know where the entrance to that is. So I'm going to look around and I will let you guys know if I find it when I get back. Oh, hey, what's that? Oh, it's another piece for the sea moth. Well, that's not going to be much use to us. Okay, whoa, okay, no wonder that sounded so loud. Hi there! Right on top of me. Let's see what we have here. Hmm. All right, let's take a look inside. Uh, okay, wrong side, I'm guessing. Wow, they made these guys get super big. That, that is insane. Alright, that door looks like a door that I can cut through. So, I believe that's this one. Uh, no, it must be this one. Yeah. Just cutting our way through. Come on. Alright. And we're already hitting, or already down by at least half of our oxygen, so let's. Okay. Let's open you up first. Every time I open one of these doors, I am always afraid that I'm gonna it's gonna open up and there's gonna be some animal or something on the other side that really doesn't like me. So I could have gotten in through there. Oh. Nope, can't get any of those. Alright, let's get some more oxygen because we've got another door to cut through. Dang, that is bright. Come on. And there we go. I don't see of anything anything of any use in here, so maybe we just got unlucky. Anyway, I'm going to keep trying to look for that for that path that I'm need for that uh, way down that I'm looking for. Obviously, I'll keep searching all these wrecks. Um, Go away! For a second there, I forgot what the button was for... to turn off the light. Anyway, so I will be back if I find anything else interesting. Is this it? I don't know. Wow, 
Look at all that fauna, though. I don't want to get out because those are tiger plants, and they would not be nice to me if I tried to get out here. That is a cool little area, though. Dang it. Ow! Ah, all these glitches. I keep crashing into stuff. Oh, big. Stop hitting me, everyone. Big wreck here. Let me s what do we have here? Oh. Yeah, I heard you. You guys still scare the ever-loving bejesus out of me. Okay, come on. There has to be a way in. I have to turn on my lights because it's starting to get dark now. What's that? I don't see a way in. Come on, it's such a big wreck. And there isn't a way in. That's the only possible way I see in, but I don't think I can do anything with this. No, it's locked from the other side. So how am I supposed to get in? Hmm. Give me a second, guys, and I'll keep, and I'll take a few more looks at this thing. I see my way in, guys. Yeah, here we go. More disinfected water. Ah, okay. Uh, repair tool. What? Or not. Still suit fragment, that'll be helpful. Means I won't need as much water. So that's not telling me it needs a ah, crud. Um Okay. Another one. Oh well, I kinda need that extra titanium. Okay. Has to be glitched. Is this? I think this is it, guys. Yeah, this is almost definitely it. Alright, well, I've got plenty of water and I've got a few nutrient blocks. I don't have any med kits. Oh, auto adjusting. Yep, this is it. So then. See that eel looking thing over there? Those live in those giant glowing mushrooms. Now what I'm trying to find down here is, let me see where, ah, more's loading in, okay. Somewhere around here okay come on okay although this is really scaring the hell out of me okay 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 Those heat plumes are in a noise from those heat plumes and everything. Those these eels isn't exactly helping. 
just passing on by guys just passing on by don't want no trouble come on where is it there's supposed to be another base down here Just trying to keep calm. If something comes out and bites me right now, I'm gonna totally lose it. And this popping because of my system isn't exactly helping. Okay. Okay, nothing down there. Come on. Where is this thing? Not over here. No, 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 no. You stay away. You stay away. She's not popping. Shut up. This is the right biome. I didn't, I don't think there's more than one. Although, obviously I could be wrong. You guys remember the ship that crashed here before us, right? Well, it's supposed to be a base from the survivors of that crash. <sighs> hey, 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 get away, get away, get away, get away. <sighs> Just trying to keep myself from totally losing it. Which, either I've got to be totally missing it. Or I took a wrong entrance, or this isn't the one that I thought it was going to be. Alright, well that was horrifying. Alright, well, I think I may have to call it there, you guys. Um, obviously, I'll keep looking. There has to be another entrance around this area. There just has to be. And uh, hopefully next time, by the time I come back, I will have found that other entrance. as well as found the appropriate place. So, as always, this has been Subnautica with Red Game Master, and this is Red, oh jeez. And this is, of course, Red Game Master signing out, and I hope you all have a wonderful day. Well, everyone, that's it for today. As always, uh, leave a like, and please subscribe if you'd like to see more. And, of course, leave a comment with any suggestions you have or something that might help me in the future. So, once again, I wish you all have a wonderful day.